What's your definition of an independent woman? Well, to me, an independent woman is somebody who can do battle about himself. Doesn't have to rely on a man. Bottles and have their own businesses. My future depends on me. You can leave them and it won't be no deal because you can still do everything you're doing before them. I think that a lot of women think it means not needing anybody and I think it means the opposite. I don't think a woman should define herself as independent by social status or economic class. You don't have to remind him you're making more money. You're not going to sit down and let me work all day. Yeah, as long as he's pulling his weight. For me, it's not the dollar amount when it comes to a relationship. It comes down to the ambition of your man. And if it's about a partnership, then really, you give a shit where the money comes from. You can make less than me, and that's okay. That's what she says. You know, a person who's a money status, I look at them as a prostitute to labels, a prostitute to material, a slave to cash. Why is it always like a double standard for a man to be a little cocky with his when a woman, she can't, she has to be extremely humble now that she has the money? I don't think that's fair. So I don't, I don't really gravitate towards the whole diva movement. I gravitate towards women. Beyonce is considered a diva. She's definitely an independent woman. If you have an ego, then you must go. Period. Be a power couple. What's wrong with that? Why can't we have power couples? You can have, you know, a married woman can say, I mean, I could be independent. I could sit on my own two feet. I, I don't choose. I choose not to take care of myself by myself. I choose to have somebody. Um, it's not like I feel like I have to have, you know, a man to complete my life. You know what I mean? I think he should be an addition. I mean, she's independent. She would, she would be able to sustain the house with uh, 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 a certain level of stability for herself with without me. You know what I'm saying? I, I compliment and I add to that. Now, okay, this is what I got. This is what you got, you know. That tends to draw competition. With independent women, it's kind of tricky. I feel like I hear that a lot of independent women are getting stuck up more and more as the years go on. They're losing their feminine side. They're going into the realm of being a man. To find somebody and to find love, you have to be willing to accept the person for who they are. Like, if you think that you're going to dominate everything and just tell me and be in control of them, there's no leverage for me to grow. If he's not thinking that he doesn't have to be independent as well, then he probably, I don't know, I can't stipulate on what he's thinking. We need to create a way for these relationships to work and, you know, people to have expectations of what they could expect out of someone else. When I say I work, first of all, I'm going to relationships saying what they ain't going to do instead of what they are going to do. I work too, I'm not going to clean up, I'm not going to do that other stuff. Well, you know what, I work. So that don't mean that your car, if your car break, I'm not supposed to fix the car, I still gotta cut the yard. If That's the burglar true. break in, I still gotta go get the break, the burglar, and I'll work. I think if we want equality, which is what we say we want, then go ahead and like own up and accept it. I'm on this guy's side, you know, we're a team, and I need for you to be a man and do what a man is supposed to do. And then, but having the man roll, we're we're looked at as if we're probably, you know what I'm saying, gonna instantly try to use. We have the negative factor always down there. Not necessarily controlled by her man, but um, she can think she can support him the way she needs to. And she wants a great man in her life, but you know what? She's not gonna go down, you know, go chasing one. Defend themselves and their thoughts and their ideas and uh, speak up. Attractive thing about a woman or a man is when they can say confidently who they are, whether it fits the norm or not. To me, that's independence. No such thing as an independent woman because we're all dependent upon each other.